Ladies and gentlemen, it's hammer time! Es wartet der WM-Finalist von 2012. Hatte zuletzt äh, einige Probleme, ist in der Angliste ein bisschen abgerutscht. Die aktuelle Nummer 55 der Welt. Schön, dass er hier in Saarbrücken mit dabei ist. The Hammer, Andy Hamilton! Andy Hamilton nimmt es mit der Nummer 50 der Welt auf. Junger Spieler aus Belgien, 22 Jahre alt, kommt aus Antwerpen. Bei dem eines klar ist, wenn er heute Abend so spielt, wie er tanzt, passiert überhaupt nichts. Die Rede ist vom Dreammaker Dimitri Vandenberg. No idea how this one could turn out. Maybe Mike Lawrence could enlighten us. Well, Andy Hamilton certainly looking to uh, regain some of that uh, form that he showed a few years ago in uh, an impressive career. He was runner-up in the World Championships in 2012, runner-up in the UK Open in 2013, and in the Players' Championship Finals, but dropped out of the top 16, then the top 32, and looking to work his way back in, but it's becoming tougher as time goes on, as we keep saying. Once you drop out, so many young talents coming through and eager to make their way up the rankings. And among them is this 23-year-old from Belgium, Dimitri Vandenberg, who was beaten by Dave Chisnell last weekend in Jena in the second European Tour event of the year. White was 6-0. But he came through the European qualifiers last night, beating Michael Tafner 6-1. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, first leg, Dimitri to throw first. Game on! And then beating Ron Mullenkamp 6-3. But it is Dimitri here who has won the throw. Fifty-seven. The yeah, Andy Hamilton, having been the beaten World Championship finalist in 2012, didn't qualify for Ali Paddy in the last stage in the tournament. So five years after being the runner-up. As a result, being a Premier League player and everything that goes with it, yeah. didn't see him at the World Championship this year. But have been a few little glimpses, little straws of hope for Andy Hamilton to grasp. The Players' Championship, a couple of weeks ago, he, he won the first three games, 6-0, 6-0, 6-2, and then got beaten by Gerwin Price, who is a player bang in form so there must be something there yet the next day I was commentating on a game on the streaming board and he was 16. terrible um, and you could see the frustration because he obviously had been winning matches hammering his opponents if you will and it just disappeared yeah it must be frustrating 41 to uh Sort of witness your game go and not know what to do to uh, recover it. He's always been a popular player 56. with the fans and on the circuit, Andy Hamilton. So it would be good to see him getting back on the uh, big TV events again and working his way back up the rankings. The winner of this one playing Kim Hybrex in round two tomorrow. A reminder that the uh, top 16 seeds all come in to the competition tomorrow to play the 16 winners of today's first round matches. 134, and he require one. A good setup shot from Vandenberg. The 160 would be a real hammer blow in this first leg. Can't do it now. There was a period where Andy Hamilton was just reaching the, the quarterfinals well, right at least of every major tournament. It's guaranteed to be in the quarterfinals. And when he was in the Premier League, he, he reached the playoffs. And he Lost out 20. to Simon Whitlock. The first year in the Premier League. 
we all know what he is capable of and he has shown it but you just wonder if it will come back wherever it's gone well, a chance for an early break of flow here if we can get this double 10 which he can't do we can't at it be true you require faulty so double top then for Vandenberg game shot in the first leg Dimitri Vandenberg second leg Andy to throw first game on and Vandenberg's been enjoying some success on the development tour two wins so far this uh, year last month for beating uh, Adam Hunt in a final 96. event Yeah, has been doing a lot of winning on the development well, tour. Well, One of these young players who often comes and puts in a very good performance in the first round, but then fails to back it up. Be interesting to see if he does face his Belgian compatriot Kim Hybrex tomorrow. Eighty-three. And Andy Hamilton to get here, he beat Wes Newton and Jamie Lewis, 6-4 and 6-5. And it, uh, he was on social media a day or so later saying how pleased he was to have finally qualified for it. He felt it could be a big turning point, but Wes Newton as well was a player that was around getting to quarterfinals that 2012 period. Yeah, Premier League player as well. It just shows the brutality as well of the two-year order of merit. 96. Because if you have a good couple of years, you've then got to back it up just to stay where you are. Definitely. And the standards rising all the time, the quality of the players coming through rising all the time. 60. Dimitri, you require 150. I only get the feeling they're just 58. dragging each other along in the early exchanges. Both quite deliberate players. And following this one, we've got a, a blockbuster between Mervyn King 56. and Robbie Green. Dimitri, you require 92. Let you make your own puns. Yes, yeah, looking forward to that one. And then Paul Nicholson against Martin Schindler as Vandenberg opted 36. for two and double eight teams, but missed with the first. Only needs one treble. And gets it. Oh well. The wrong one. So he'll just look to tidy up. Well, yeah, he fancied following Which that into the treble to leave double six, but had he just secured a, a big 19, he'd have had a short bullseye. Now, double 18. Move the wire, and he clip it in. Game show on the second leg. And Dimitri, Dimitri doubles his lead. Third leg, Dimitri to throw first. Game on. And a break of throw. And you feel Vandenberg could be 96. a popular character on the scene. He's got his dance moves and uh, has a cheeky grin on his face. And hopefully a star of the future. One of Andy Hamilton. Oh, it's his first 180 of the match. Well, it's Vandenberg about to follow in kind. There's going to switch. One on right on 39. Vandenberg lost out to 58. Crystal Reyes at the World Championship. 3 2. Before Reyes went and gave Michael Van Gogh in a very good game at Alexandria Palace. 134. Did win 
two games at the Grand Slam of darts and then didn't get out of the group in one of those. Works of bad luck. Hamilton started with a maximum. Puts a bit of pressure onto Victory Vandenberg. You think, well, I was going to say, if that went into treble 19, 64. the dart above the bullseye and was perfect. Well, it's been a good leg from Hamilton, but he needs to finish it off and stop the rock against the young Belgian. We'll be coming back here for 68. Wow, an unlucky bounce out, not what you need. Dimitri, you require 68. Well, he was down there for a while, digging the dart off the floor. He'll be feeling like he's on the floor if Vandenberg lands this finish. 32. Bent the wire of the double 18. And you require 86. The bounce out means it might only be a dart of the bull for Andy Hamilton. Well, he might not even be that lucky. Doesn't get a dart at any 30. double. The meter you require 36. So three darts then for Dimitri to go 3 Being nil. Up. Only the needs the one. Leg. Dimitri van der Berg. Full flag Andy to throw first. Game on. And uh, plenty to think about then. Randy Hamilton. As he gets us underway at the start of the fourth leg. The uh, evening session on the first 43. day of the German Darts Open here in Saarbrücken. Great crowd in this evening for a Friday night, ready to start the weekend with a party. 96. There's only one man on the stage feeling like partying right now. And it's not the one we're looking at. 60. You can see the frustration creeping out. Shake of the head from Hamilton and Vandenberg looking to punish. One and when he's got the first start right, the others have followed. He made it look easy, didn't he? So uh, Hamilton just trying to compose himself, get himself together to try and uh, pick start his game here. One round right oh, that's better. 40. Well it's the first time this pair have ever met. And Andy Hamilton right now struggling to contend with the young Belgian. Dreammaker giving his opponent nightmares on the hockey. Bearing down the barrel here, Hamilton of a 4 0 deficit. Dimitri, you require. With Dimitri to throw first in the fifth leg. Thirty-four. Well, he's got a bit of time, Dimitri, having gone round the houses there, but he'll be back for a potential two-dart finish. But Hamilton can put a bit of pressure on it if he fills this bed up. One hundred and thirty-eight. Dimitri, you require fifty-four. But he's been leaving double eighteen, so he'll probably go for the single eighteen. But he's left it a bit awkward. Yeah, very close to the double. Double nine. 45. Well, that's uh, always the. And he requires 68. Danger. He's offered Andy Hamilton a route back into this. Six starts from 88. Finds himself on nine. Now the hammer. 48. Misses double top. Dimitri, you require nine. Just dropped short. Just not happening at the moment for Andy Hamilton. One for double four. For Game four shot on the full flag. 
Dimitri van der Berg. Fifth leg, Dimitri to throw first. Game on. And he has the throw here. Does the man from Merksem in Belgium. 80. Well, he knocked one of the darts out. Well. Two darts in treble 20, through the third, hit the single 20, and one of the previous darts came out. That is bad fortune. 90. And Andy Hamilton needs a bit of a rub of the green in this one, though. Certainly does. One way back from 4 0 down. 55. Great side on view there of the tungsten. 44. One and run out 40. Vandenberg looks in complete control. Yes, I'm not sure what odds you would have got uh, with Happy Bet for a 6 0 whitewash for Vandenberg. One on right on 40. You mentioned a couple of uh, development tour titles he's got this year earlier, Mike. That takes his tally up One to on nine right on, 40. on the development and challenge tours combined. It's impressive, isn't it? Yeah, just. Remains to be seen if he, if he can make the, the big step up to the winning titles or having big runs in senior One tournaments. Right on 34. But Which this. You require 86. Against the player of Andy Hamilton's stature. Despite what he's throwing. Game it's very, very impressive. Leg. Clinical kill on the 86. Six leg Andy to throw first. And we could be about to see our first whitewash of the day. Yes, Andy Hamilton needs to stop the rot and stop it very quickly indeed. And he's getting this six leg off to an absolute flyer. With his second maximum of the match. Well, you've got to wonder what, he's think, what he must be thinking now. 5 0 down, fires in a, a beautiful 180. That wasn't far away from following suit. A couple of times he's drifted into the treble 16. seven and the last start seems pretty rushed. And he looks like a man who may be resigned to defeat in this one. So it looks like we're on course to set up an all-Belgium affair tomorrow in round two with Kim Hybrechts awaiting the winner of this one and Dimitri Vandenberg 85 very close to the finishing line here we go again one on right on well, 21 just clipped the second dart and drifted into the one but he is on a decent finish when he comes back And he's done it without really Bolton. having to break sweat. Sure you Vandenberg looking at 104 then. To seal a 6 0 win. Fifty-six. And you require one hundred and thirty-six. Well, a big out shot. But this may well be what Andy Hamilton needs to spark his One arm right arm first 16. round into life. But it may be Dimitri, you require too, little, too late in any case. Well, it would have been a flashy way to finish, wouldn't it? The 136. 
Game shot. But it's heartbreak for Hamilton. A 6 0 defeat in the hands of the Belgian youngster, Dimitri Vandenberg. Just five starts of double in that match, Andy Hamilton had, and he crashes out in the first round. 6 0 to the Belgian, who we will hear from in just a moment. And then we've got the big clash between Mervyn King and Robbie Green. Stay tuned for that. Ein glatter Erfolg für Dimitri Vandenberg über den Hammer, Andy Hamilton. Trotzdem klasse, dass Andy Hamilton hier in Saarbrücken mit dabei war. Dimitri, gratuliere dir. Am Ende ein ganz schön glatter Erfolg über Andy Hamilton. Das ist schon eine Nummer. Der, der war vor kurzem, gefühlt vor kurzem noch im WM-Finale. Er tut sich schwer. Wenn es wichtig wird, tut er sich schwer, die richtigen Felder zu treffen. Ja, weißt du, Andy Hamilton, wenn man ehrlich ist, die Leute das wissen, wie es abgeht in Darts. Andy Hamilton war ein Premier League-Spieler. Also der bleibt immer noch einfach der größte Spieler im Darts. Wenn man bei Premier League spielt, dann weißt du, was man kann. Aber dass ich gegen ihn jetzt 6-0 gewinnen kann, ja. 17, der wird 18, ein von 13, ein von 4. Die sind dann sehr fande Berg, Leute, meine kleinen Brüder, dass in Bergen hoffentlich auch stärker und groß werde. Also von ihm weiß ich dann, dass es dort in Bergen besser wird, größer wird. Aber abwarten, im Moment immer das Gleiche, aber meine Brüder sind auch Talentspieler. Jetzt ernsthaft, wie, wie bei der Familie Rodriguez sozusagen. Die haben ja auch alle vier Brüder, spielen richtig gut Arzt. Seine Brüder sind richtig gut, ja? Ja, einer, der ist jetzt vier Jahre alt, der spielt jetzt so genau wie ich hier stehe auf dem Boot und er trifft das Boot und er sieht so zu mir, Bruder, hast du das mal gesehen? Ich habe Bruder getroffen. Ich denke, Alter, du bist vier Jahre alt. Jetzt schön? Also krass, ich finde es geil. Okay, also... Aus Belgien kommt auf jeden Fall irgendwann ein Weltmeister aus dem Hause Vandenberg. Dimitri, danke dir. Wir sehen uns morgen wieder. Dimitri Vandenberg, der Dreammaker. Der sich freut, morgen die nächste Runde zu spielen.